Hey ladies, so yesterday was my first day of support and I had an amazing time even though we were only there for four hours and it was our orientation. So let me go fast forward, rewind back to the first, the beginning of the day. So I woke up around 5 o'clock, got ready, because I had to be there at 8, so I wanted to take my time to do my makeup and stuff like that and get there and kind of find where I was going. Because the way she told me to go was like I had to go through one of the docks. So when I got that, I went through Doxy and oh my goodness, you know how you always thought about like, the back hallways and malls but never really seen them yeah they're kind of creepy don't want to be back there so um i kind of got lost and then i ended up randomly walking into like i opened a door and i was there in the mall <laughs> but the mall was kind of creepy like the, the hallway was kind of lit up from like the sunlight of course but then the stores are dark <laughs> and it was just mannequins and i couldn't find a person at all and i'm walking around like scared a little bit because it was kind of creepy just mannequins and you and it was a little weird so I finally found a security guy and he showed me the way to get to Sephora. He was really nice about it because sometimes I, you would think he's like, so why are you here? Da, da, da. But he was really nice about it. Like, um, you know, you take this hallway, da da da, up these stairs. Okay, thank you. Cause I knew where it was at in the mall, but I had to get there the back way. She told me to go the back way, whatever, you know, like the escalators and elevators are not working at that time. Okay. So I did that, or whatever, and then I kept ringing the doorbell in the back, and no one was answering, so I just walked around and went to the front, and then that's where I met this girl named Alex, who's also there for orientation. She's really nice, and I met another girl named Melina, and three of the girls came back. I really cannot remember their name, and that's sad. I really just remember that name because my coworkers now. Um, so we got there, we went to the back when the manager got there, and we um filled out our tax forms and stuff like that. You know, just like the personal things we need to do for the job. They're like our check stubs for direct deposit, stuff like that. So, um, the first thing that we did, we did a tour of the store just to, like, get to run the products and know where everything is at, basically. So, so I felt like I was in makeup heaven, <laughs> in a way, because it was just, like, you know, learning a little bit more about different products that I've heard about but never really used before, like, Makeup Forever, and I'm an Urban Decay girl, so I, love, I know a lot of stuff about Urban Decay. I can't afford it at all times, believe me, I, but I still keep up on it. And know what's I really want their new smoke palette, but that's not what I'm talking about here today. So we um went around the whole store, talked about everything, and she just told us how we, you know, what our job descriptions were and what we had to do, and basically how we can actually grow in the company and how they have their own makeup classes and we can get certified as makeup artists. And it was really cool because like, and the thing is like we I was we all we went all went back to the back, so we all started talking, and then everybody was like talking about they're going to school. For, everybody was going to school for makeup except me. And I was like, I'm going to be a doctor, but technically I'm not because I'm taking a semester. I have to honestly figure out what the heck I want to do with my life. My parents kind of freaked out, but that's okay. But um, and I just love makeup, and everybody was like, Oh my goodness, you shouldn't be a doctor. You're calling this makeup because they were just basically talking about the makeup I wore yesterday, which I have none on right now. It's Sunday. I'm in the, not Sunday. Ooh, where is Monday? <laughs> and I'm in the house today. I'm just resting. Um, so the first thing she gave us a little um booklet, and it says, "Welcome to Sephora," and on the back it says Sephora University. But um, in the beginning it's "Welcome to Sephora," the beginning of a Sephora career, and then it has like a little um table of contents. And then um, the next page is like the history of Sephora and different things like that. Um, I'm not going to tell you everything because I think some of this stuff is private. Like I'm not going to tell you the discount, I'm not going to tell you my, how much I make. But um, it's decent, it's decent, I'll tell you that. Um, it's talking about our appearance, like keep your nails done all right, all times, clothes clean of course, um, shoes clean of course, all black, makeup looking nice. Um, a bunch of different things about how you should treat your customers and like their principles they have and like different events that Sephora will do and like their hot now products if you've seen those like when you first come in and like in glass cases those are called their hot now products so you should go check those out um, another thing that we got that you actually can get yourself too if you want to look at it is um, their color vision book for fall looks and this is how the book looks and it opens up like this and it shows you different makeup looks so, so like this, this is the black is black flicker liner this is basically talking about different liners looks you can do and winged out look but it's a lot more different things in there and another book that she gave 
this but she kind of wants us to know the brushes because somebody asked me for something but we can't just walk around like uh basically being like them so you can also pick this up too but it's basically you know talking about sephora brushes and what they're for different things like that so that was good um my manager seems really really nice i really really like everybody that so far that i've came across that i work there with um my first official day i don't know yet she's supposed to call today but i haven't received a phone call so she doesn't call by tomorrow afternoon i'll probably call her myself but they did give us a sephora bag a clear sephora bag to put our makeup in because we're only allowed five makeup items just so we need confusion with, with um people taking products and different things like that so i'll be putting my five little products in here um so let me get to the gratis we did get gratis on the first day and gratis is like basically three products they want us to try out and different things like that and from what i heard for the grapevine like you get a lot of it i really don't you know of course i don't know for sure yet but i wanted to show you a couple of things that i did get i'm just trying to get a little organized for you sorry guys so the first thing i got i got um all of them I got some velvet lips. Have you ever heard of velvet lips? They're like the lip tattoos. I got two in red, two in gold, two in pink, and I think three in silver because I'm going to use these for a special event at the store. Another thing that I got was a vegan nail polish and it's by Spartacle, like Spiritual Spartacle. It's a vegan nail polish. It doesn't have all the harsh chemicals. It's in the color sage. Really, really pretty. I'm gonna have to try it. It's kind of similar to the color I have on my nails now, which is kind of chipped. So don't look at that. Um, the next thing that I, I got was um, it's a hair mascara, a hair color mascara, a color hair mascara from Sultra, and I got the color Ultra Pink. Cause that's my favorite color. It looks like a little, yeah, like a mascara one. I'm going to um, test it out for you guys. You just take it like this and wind it on your hair. And you let it dry. You have a pink. Yeah, that looks awkward now. I'm just going to put it under my little mini thing. Okay, let's see. Let's fix that. Little pink patch hanging out, but yeah, I thought this would be cool for Halloween. Use it, who knows? Um, another thing that I did get was a NARS lip gloss in the color Sand Dipper, really cute, bronzy brown color. Let me see if I can do a little swatch for you guys. It looks like this really, really gorgeous color. I can you see it. My camera's high okay, there really really gorgeous color um i will be using this um another thing that i got was a bare minerals it's called a all over face color in the fake tan i'm probably just going to end up using this as a eyeshadow because i this little thing for all over face is not even my color but it is really um, powdery so i just don't chop anything um, so the last thing, actually, um, not the actually, it's not the last thing, sorry about that. The next thing I got was a smash, hmm, excuse me, camera. The next thing I got was a Smashbox eye uh, gel, it was a gel eyeliner, cream eyeliner, and it's in a brown. Really gorgeous color. The next thing that I got, she gave me a sample since I do have natural hair. She gave me, well, she gave everyone a sample, but she wants to try to give me another one of these. It's a, um. Carol's daughter, Monet, repairing sulfate-free shampoo and repairing conditioner. So I'm going to test this out, and I'll probably do the, um, or like a little review on how I feel about this, and I might end up buying the full package if I like it. And so this is actually the last thing that I got, and it is also from Sultra. It's the hair, um, the color clip-in hair extension, and I, and I got it in the color cypress violet let me take it up so you can see how it looks and i probably will end up using this probably on my birthday and of course halloween my birthday's a couple days after halloween i kind of messed it up a little bit but um this can be curled and this can be straightened so when i do 
probably get um, trapped for Halloween or Christmas or, or something like that, whenever I do. I'll probably add this in one day to see how it look, curl it up with the hair. But um, that was the gratis I got. So I'm really excited to start my job. This, I don't know, I wouldn't say dream come true, but this is like amazing. Like this is all, I love makeup. I probably don't make a collection for you soon because I have a lot of makeup over here. And I just love it and I'm really excited about starting something new and fresh it's something i'm actually happy about doing because my past job i really could not stay in that job at all but i'm really happy about this one and i'm really excited and i, I can't wait to share more things with you guys and do more um hopefully gratis hauls i like getting gratis that's really nice i've never been anywhere like i never worked anywhere that gave you so much stuff and she's like that's just the beginning of it <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. Um, if you have any more questions, please email me or write me a message on here or anything or down below. Please subscribe, like the video if you like it, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.